Hello friends around the world. I'm Selena for Who is Jesus Today. And you can tell by the way I'm dressing here outside that I am not coming to you from the sunny warm of Bahamas, right? <laughs> well, Florida, that's right. Or the warm regions of Colombia. I just want to say and to remind us this upcoming week to be praying for the United States of America, for uh, the cities in the U.S., and for prayers over a New York City. Whatever outcomes are there, that there will be, uh, there won't be mass uh, chaos. I come against the spirit of, of violence, and um, yes. Uh, people have a right to state their positions, absolutely, but we want to uh, pray for a covering in Jesus' name, the blood of Jesus, and that there's no a trampling on a people uh, in, in the streets and the atmosphere, and that things will stay under control. And I'm going to read Psalm 91 again for the upcoming week over New York City. He who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God in Him I will trust. Surely He shall deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. He shall cover you with his feathers, and under his wings you shall take refuge. Uh, his truth shall be your shield and buckler. You shall not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day, nor of the pestilence that walks in darkness, nor of the destruction that lays waste at noonday. I want to emphasize nor of the destruction that lays waste at noonday. A thousand may fall at your side and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you, no matter what is going on around you. Only with your eyes shall you look and see the reward of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord, who is my refuge, even the Most High, your dwelling place, no evil shall befall you, nor shall any plague come near your dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over you. He will give his angels charge over the city of New York and the cities in America. To keep you in all your ways, in their hands, lest they, uh, in their hands, they shall bear you up lest you dash your foot against a stone. You shall thread upon the lion and the cobra, the young lion and the serpent you shall trample underfoot. Because he has set his love upon me, therefore I will dwell, I will deliver him. Uh, I will set him on high because he has known my name. He shall call, he shall call upon me and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble, I will deliver him and honor him. With long life I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. And that is applicable for where it needs to be. And yeah, so right now just um, kind of enjoying the sunset here. Well, I think it's just about set. And I, that's, this is a short uh, video. I can make them short at times. And guess what? I'm getting cold. <laughs> I'm getting a little cold. Uh, and so I'm going to go in and to all of you, my friends in the United States of America and around the world, uh, God loves you. Wherever you find yourself today, that's right. And he is as close, Jesus, as the mention of his name. Whatever you need, you can call on the Lord in the day of trouble. 
he, is, he will answer. Call with all your heart. Thank you. And it's going to be a day, it's going to be a week that we're going to give God glory and honor for the things that he is doing and has done. Okay, leaving now. It's getting nighttime. Shalom.